So here's the problem. More than three quarters of the American population believe that climate change is happening, but less than a quarter of those people are actually doing anything about it. With Cool the Earth, we are addressing that issue of getting people engaged and taking action. Our program inspires kids and gives them the tools to involve the whole family in reducing their carbon footprint. When are we gonna be home? <laughs> I don't know, honey. Our habitat, it seems to be gone. The program starts with an educational and really fun assembly in which the teachers don the costumes of polar bears and the villainous Mr. Carbon, uh, teaching the kids about climate change and also ways that they can make a difference. I am Mr. Carbon. I like to make the earth hot. After the assembly, the kids take home an action coupon book, which contains easy ways for the whole family to start reducing their carbon footprint. Once they take an action with the family, the kids return these coupons to the school. I did shorter showers and I did um, layer up, layer down and real reusable bottle and bag. How many actions is your family taking? Not many. I'm, I'm teaching them a little bit. You are excellent. The coupons are then tallied and marked on a banner so everybody at school can see that every action does count. We were more uh, efficient with our recycling. We have glass and paper containers, which we didn't have before. We used to dump everything into one big bin. Like plastic bags go in landfill, plastic bottles go in recycle. Uh, uh, we're turning off a light, lights and using le uh, a less a power. We are turning off lights by our kids' insistence that we're wasting energy. Um, we are again riding bikes or walking to school more often. I know from my experience my kids will tell me as soon as I'm even at a stop sign um, idling for a moment coming to a complete stop um, they'll say mom turn the car off. I'll have to explain at that time that I can't but any kind of waiting um, I'm always turning the car off before they can remind me. These kids are don't have a bit of cynicism in them. They are uh, they just see the world as a wonderful place and full of uh, promise and it's, the, it's their future. One of the most important things I've learned is probably that global warming isn't permanent. We can help fix it. What I have noticed is that the kids really are making the connections between what they're doing and moving back to what the carbon impact is and then moving back from there what the impact on the environment is. Working with children is such a dramatic difference. They have hope. They are powerful. They know that what they do makes a difference. That is the world from a child, child's view. And that view will move their families and will move communities and will move nations. We know our